Hello there from downtown Seattle. You know, growing up in this city, I never missed a game. I wore his shoes. I'm still wearing a pair of his socks. I started doing this thing with my hair when he did it. I guess you could say I'm rather invested in Seattle supersonic legend Sean Kemp. And good news today, he's investing in the city. The name of it is Sean Kemp Cannabis. It's a big day for the Rain Man. It is, man. It's a big day. Store opening is today at First Avenue. So uh, we've been looking forward to it. A lot of hard work has been put into this. Uh, we have a lot of young people down here working. That's what I'm most happy about. As you can look around, we have a mix, mixed nationality of young people that's working here. That's what I'm most proud about. So in a tough time as it is right now with the coronavirus going around, we've been able to uh, bring young people in, work with them, and we'll open up this cannabis store. You've been a local business owner before. Why invest in cannabis and why now? I think at a time like this, it's about just giving back, making sure people have a good job, creating a game plan that works for me, something that's going to be authentic, and we've done that. It took me a while to do this. This wasn't something I just jumped into, so it was a thought-out process. This is the first of uh, five stores that's going to open for me pretty quickly, so uh, the game plan is pretty good, and we're just going to try to service people. You're busy in here, sweating, doing all these TV interviews. Are you aware that your fans are lined up down the street? When I came in, I saw that line outside, and it made me proud of. So I'm a, I'm a proud Seattle guy, man. I'm bringing Gary Payton in. I had to work a little bit to get Gary to come in. He's coming in from sunny California. Y'all the best fans ever could happen, man. Right. Ever. Yeah. Right. So you know, I came out here to support my boy. Yeah. I'm about to yeah. hand this to him, man. He about to open yeah. up this and y'all get it going. Yeah. It's a huge responsibility. So I had to really think about this before I put my name on this project. When you'll see me put my name on a brand, it will probably be something as in something to help older people, medicine, things of that nature. So that's more of what I'm interested in in the future in the marijuana products.